Imagine having 50 bank accounts in 50 different countries. I bet you do not need that much bank accounts, but nevertheless, in this video, I'll be showing you how to create and verify an account on WISE, formerly known as TransferWISE, a service which you can use to send, receive, keep, and spend money in over 50 currencies all over the world. I personally, I consider TransferWISE to be one of the cheapest platforms you can use to send and receive money abroad. So without wasting much of your time, let's get started. So to create an account on WISE, you just need to come to WISE.com or you can also create your account by clicking on the first link in the description below. If you use that link, your first transaction is going to be for free. That is if you are sending an amount of up to 500 British pounds, the first transaction is going to be for free. So you can go ahead and click on the link and follow along as you create your account. Once you click on that link, you are going to be directed to this page. You can see my name over here. So in here, you can either create a personal account or a business account. But for a business account, you need to have a registered business in order to create a business account. So you can just go ahead and start with a personal account. And you can later on, like it, upgrade this account into a business account if you want to be using your account for business. So the first thing that we need to do is to enter the email address. Then we also need to create a password. Then you just need to come and press on where it says claim your free transfer. The next thing you need to do is to add and verify your phone number. So you just need to come over here and search for your country code. So mine is Turkey. Then you enter your phone number here. Then after that, you just press on it, send verification code. Then you just need to enter the security code sent to your mobile phone number. So I'll enter it here. And then press submit. After that, you will be brought to this page where they are prompting you to make a transfer. So you can see that if you are to send a thousand dollar to Turkey from any European country, you only be paying 5.5 in fees. So, and the, the transaction would only take about 10 minutes. Let me just go ahead and show you how to set up your account without making a transfer. So you just need to come and press on this one. So after that, you are going to be brought to the home page. This is the place where you are going to be managing your account from. So you can see that you can manage your cards there. You can manage the recipients and also manage the accounts, the balances. So you can see that they do also provide you with a card which you can use uh, to pay for transactions online. You can also use this card to withdraw money from almost any ATM in the world. So the first thing that you need to do, you just need to set up your account. So you, come, you need to come and press on where it says set up account. Then here you need to enter your personal information. You just have to make sure that the details you are entering are correct. So for me, I'm going to be using my passport to fill out this form. So I will go ahead and fill out the form. Once you are done filling all your personal information, you just need to come and press on here where it says save. After saving your personal information, you just need to come over here where it says get started and press on it. So you can see over here that you can keep your money in over 50 currencies. So it's more like having 50 bank accounts in 50 different countries. So in here, you just need to come and press on where it says let's go. Then here, we just need to choose the currency and open an account. So you can see that you can create an account with all of these currencies. In all of these countries, you can create an account. So I will go ahead and open a USD account. That's more like adding a bank account in the USA. So when I search for US dollar, it will come up. I just need to press on it. Then I just need to press on it, confirm. As simple as it seems, the bank account has been created. Like an account has been created in your name in the USA, like a dollar account. So I will go ahead and add other accounts, uh, open another account. Since I'm in Turkey, I will also open a Terra account. So I'll just need to come and press on it, open an account. You just need to come under account if you want to add an account and come and press on it, open account. Then you do the same, you need to choose the currency. So I will choose the Turkish Lira and then I will press confirm again. Uh, you can see that under account, an account in Turkish Lira has been opened. 
So you can just go ahead and add the accounts in the currencies you want. So in order to start using your WISE account, you will need to verify your account. And to verify your account, you need to make a deposit of a certain amount, depending on the country where you have registered your account from. It is usually around $20, but it all just depends on the country of registration. So to do that, you just need to come, like for me, I'm in Turkey, so I just need to open my Turkey, the, the, the Turkey account. I need to press on it. Then I just need to come over here and press on it, get account details. Then you will be directed to this page where they are telling you to deposit 100 Terry. Then after that, I will need to verify my identity. So I just need, I'll need to verify my ID card or my passport. So I just need to come and press on it, uh, get account details again. Uh, so here you'll be able to see the amount you are depositing. Then there you'll be able to see the currency you are using to deposit. So it is much better to use your local currency when depositing money. That way you won't be charged on the deposit. So I will just go ahead and press on it, continue. Then here you just need to press on it. I understand they're just telling you how to make the transfer. So you can just go ahead and press on it, I understand. Then you'll be provided with this high band. So you're going to use this account. You're going to send money to this account. Then transfer is you'll be able to track that transaction. Then the money will be deposited into your WISE account. But when transferring it, you have to make sure that you enter your reference code. Failure to that, you might end up losing your money or your money might not be tracked as quick as possible. So I will go ahead and make a transfer of 100 Terry to this account. Then I will be able to proceed with the verification. So immediately after making the transfer, you just need to come over here and press on I have made my bank transfer. And then at this step, uh, you will need to verify your identity. So you are going to verify your identity by taking pictures of your ID or passport and also taking a picture of yourself, then it's going to be matched. That way, uh, they are going to verify your identity. So you need to choose one of these. Uh, you can choose to receive the link or just scan a QR code uh, to get access to the application which you are going to use to take the pictures of your passport or your ID. So I will go with email. So I will go ahead and use my phone to take the pictures of my passport to complete the verification. So you can see over here that we have been able to add money successfully and our verification is complete. So what we need to do is to come down here and press on it, got it. You can see that now I have access to the account details of my account. That is my high ban and the name there. So now I can be able to use this account to send and receive money within Turkey. This applies to the other balances. So in order to check the account details of my USD dollar account, I just need to come and press here. And if I scroll down, you'll be able to see that uh, that's my name there, the account number, and uh, it's a checking account. There is also the address there. So I can be able to use this account to receive and send money in the USA. Like it would work like a local bank account in the USA. It's more like having a bank account in USA. You can give also like these details if you have got someone who wants to pay you in USA, then they'll be able to send money to this account. Then it will be credited to your USD account. So like this is how you use your account details. So this is how you use WISE to manage your money. I hope this video has been helped to you. If it did, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you very much for watching all the way to the end. See you in the next video.